Yeah, today Madhvi and Nevi going for a little ride. So she's also one of my youngsters, although she's not that young. She's uh, six years, or she'll be six years next spring. So I'm having her, I had her under the saddle for a while, but I haven't really ridden her much. So today we'll do a ride just the two of us. So she'll be out alone, which I think is very important young horses should learn. And you can see I still ride her with a simple knot halter because I start all my young horses uh, in this one so that they first learn all the basics bit by bit when they get more responsive and know the basics I usually change into a bridle most of the time not always sometimes I, I love riding bitless because I think it's so much easier when you're out on the trail so the horse can graze on the way but yeah so you can you're welcome today to accompany me on my ride I'm on horseback and um, ah, it's always nice to be to get out a little bit from the farm and get away from daily work and just ride the horses so I always have some good excuses to ride my to train my horses at the moment or to ride my youngsters so that's always nice so you can see the beautiful nature at the moment everything is green I'm still very close to the farm just behind it and now we're heading out on our trail. In a minute you can see our lake. Okay. Riding up to the dam. Which is quite beautiful. Uh, you can see the lake there. It's just slowly getting we're coming for sunset. Uh, this is the best time of the day to ride I think because um, it's not as hot. It's pretty hot in the daytime but it's uh, very nice now at this time of the day. Oh, just riding over our lake. People who have been riding here know this vista because most of our rides start or end going over this lake. You can see it's a lot of water, it's very beautiful at the moment. And it's very green and lush, we're just at the end of monsoon. And there, Rocky, our, our little Doberman puppy, he's not really grown up yet, coming along with us and having fun to come with us on the upside, walking on the wall. Come Rocky. Madvi is a little hesitating because we are going out alone today. I haven't taken her out alone for quite a while. So it's good to do this once in a while with a young horse so that she will get used to it and you know be calm and come to trust me when we go together alone without any other horses. I think it's so important that young horses learn that straight from the beginning. So, and here we are now, a bit further away from the farm. You can see I'm busy cutting off uh, some of the branches because my paths are overgrown. So this is the kind of trails I really enjoy riding a lot because um, well, they are a little difficult. Okay. There's no ways here, and uh, but it's very beautiful. And I'm pretty alone out here. There's nobody around here. There's a little valley, so we're going to go there.
So this is one of the examples I want a good trail horse to be. Me standing in the middle of the bushes and cutting away branches. And the horse standing there, basically, where I'm asking her to stand. You can see I have my garden shears and this is what I have to cut. So there's plenty of Montana. And you can see I'm not even holding her reins. I just parked her here. I told her to stop and stand. She's not really comfy because she's alone. So this stuff here is Lantana. Lantana is a weed. It's not native to India, but native to the West Indies. But the British thought it looked pretty, so they brought it here. And now I have to cut this all away. Come, come madam. Forward. Voila. So you can see it's fairly tight going here, but she's done well. And there she goes. Good girl. Come, 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 come. So. And here we go, cross country. Down on the riverbed and up from the riverbed. And the dog always is following us. And then, well, look at this. It's so beautiful here. It's so super cool. This is one of the reasons I love riding in these mountains. You can always discover a couple of these kind of, you know, really lonely valleys, places we haven't been. She's looking at the stones left and right. Yeah, but it's it's a nice trail. I like to ride up here um, So you can see The countryside now the Sun has set behind the mountain. So this is usually means it's six o'clock and uh, I can see it's slightly there, but yeah, the main Sun is behind the mountain now So that means I have to see that I get back now uh, we have to make a little speed now on the second part of the trail because the first part has been very slow on account of all these bushes we had to cut. And uh, you can see I picked up a couple of uh, ah, these horrible birds. 
but that's well that was to be expected And you can see we're almost back at the farm. It's slowly getting dark and dinner's waiting for Madhvi. She was a great host today and uh, so glad that you joined us. I hope you enjoyed this little clip of our ride together and I hope I'll see you again next week for the next clip. <laughs>